Hello, how to solve for x and y in this equation? x plus y is equal to 20, x y is equal to 40. Solution. x plus y is equal to 20. Let's call this equation 1. x y is equal to 40. Let's call this equation 2. From equation 1, we make y the subject of the formula. s plus y is equal to 20 y is equal to 20 minus x let's call this equation 3 then from equation 2 x y is equal to 40 let's substitute for y here we have s bracket 20 minus s is equal to 40 Let's open the bracket. We have 20x minus s square is equal to 40. Let's bring this 40 to this side. Here is 20x minus s square minus 40 is equal to 0. Now let's put this in standard form. We have this is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this using quadratic general formula. From our quadratic general formula, we have s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a and from this equation a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 20 c is equal to 40. so here we have discriminant d is equal to b square minus 4ac then this is equal to minus 20 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by c is 40 then this is equal to minus 20 square that is 400 minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 40 that is 1 60 then this is equal to 400 minus 160 that is 240 discriminant d is equal to 240 now let's plug this back into this equation into this formula let's plug this back into this formula s is equal to minus bracket minus 20 plus or minus square root of 240 over 2 multiplied by 1. Then S is equal to minus times minus 20. This is 20 plus or minus square root of 240 can be written as square root of 16 multiplied by 15 everything over 2 times 1 2 then x is equal to 20 plus or minus square root of 16 4 then root 15 over 2 therefore x is equal to 20 over 2 plus or minus 4 over 2 root 15 2 here 1, 2 here 10, 2 here 1, 2 here 2. X is equal to 10 plus or minus 2 root 15. This is the value of X. Then we can solve for Y. To solve for Y, From equation 3, y is equal to 20 minus x. Now, y1 will be equal to 20 minus s1 here will be 10 plus 2 root 15. 10 plus 2 root 15. Then, y1 is equal to 20 minus times 10, that is minus 10, 
the minus times plus two that is minus two then root 15. now y1 will be equal to 20 minus 10 that is 10 minus 2 root 15. this is the value of y1 also y2 will be equal to 20 minus s2 here will be 10 minus 2 root 15. then 10 minus 2 root 15. y2 is equal to 10 minus 2 10 plus 2 root 15. This is the value of y2. Therefore, our final answer are s1, y1 is equal to 10 plus 2 root 15 comma 10 minus 2 root 15 then s2 comma y2 is equal to 10 minus 2 root 15 comma 10 plus 2 root 15. Here you can see that S1 here is equal to Y2 here and then Y1 here is equal to S2 here. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Bye.